hi guys welcome to another vlog um i can't decide whether i want my hair what this hairband it makes all these weird little bits of my hair but i can't decide if i want it like this because i'm going i'm going roller skating um i'm actually quite excited it's like a drinking over 18s only um <laughs> roller skating thing in a place called Red Ruth. But I don't know what to wear. Yeah, I think I'm wearing this and then just these like low rise jeans and then trainers, but obviously change into roller skates. But I can't decide if I want my hair like this or not, or just down, because I normally would curl it, this headband. Mm. I also need to put some lip gloss on, but I'm waiting, I'm cooking. Classic uni meal, pesto pasta. But I'm gonna try and bring my camera with me if I find a bag. But also don't know if it's safe for my camera if I'm drinking and roller skating. Yeah, it can be filming this on my phone in the next few clips. But if I find a bag that goes in my outfit, then I'll bring my camera. Why is my camera flashing red? It's fully charged. Me and Reese are off for the roller skating. I've got these slushies, these like strawberry daiquiri slushies from Lidl. Lidl. They're really nice. Right there, berry, it's actually real nice. Oh, mm-hmm. It's only like three pounds as well. But we're in a bit of a rush to get the bus because a bit late because eating pasta but I'm gonna go because I've got a crossroad. We're here for the roller skating place as Joe although he just dropped his phone down a big pole. I've got Netflix starting. I've got new pants on. Same bed. I've got wristbands. But we're gonna go back on soon because too hungry and need to eat. I just felt that on my arm. And quite nasty for as well. Oh my god, I look a mess. It's the next day. I don't know how much I filmed yesterday, but just done a workout, an ab workout. The her name Palmer Palmer Re no Pamela Reef. That's how you say her name. It's really good for ab workouts. So I'm trying to get back into it for summer body. So yeah, I'm just trying to get back into my workouts, but now I film this. I need to get in the shower, wash this tan off because I tanned last night and yeah, I just need to wash it off, get ready. And I'm filming a cup shoe haul. So that video might be out before this one. Probably will be actually. So if you want to watch that, go watch that. <laughs> um, it's bikini haul. I'm filming for them and then later, I might, I'm basically making some pyjamas, so I might carry on doing that, and then it's a Friday by the way, so might go out for drinks tonight, but everyone, most of my friends are like from the Exeter campus that I hit in Falmouth, and they have, some I'm a bit off breath from the workout, I need to breathe, um, so they have exams this week coming, and next, so not many people are going out tonight, but I might just go out for some cocktails, with a few friends. I'm not really sure. My skin is so bad. I'm getting spots. Guys, I've just finished filming my bikini video. This is now the mess because that's been caused by the video because whenever I do a haul, like this space, hang on, let me show you. This space is spotless. When I do my haul, it's like clean, tidy room. But no, it'll just, it'll just get stuffed down there. <laughs> so I actually just do need to sort that out. But I want to show my outfit because I love it. This is the outfit i love it it is kind of big this skirt got it from a sale at uni but for some reason the seams are on the outside that's really nice stop it max is back now so i'm gonna go right i've balanced you right on my mirror guys i've decided i'm gonna go out it's one of those nights where i was like i want to go out but then so i need to put my eyeliner on as well i was like yeah i want to go out but then i just felt so tired because i filmed a whole day so i don't know i feel like it just like really takes it out of me afterwards i'm like oh my god oh so i feel like i get so high point i'm doing it you know what yeah i'm gonna put my butterfly earrings in oh my god i'm on low charge what the hell fuck oh shit i'm gonna have to go reese what did you get Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> so we like what it's like when I'm on below deck. 
Biggie's so tired. Reese is here now. And Beth. Little dog sitting. Little baby sitting. Little baby. Family goes. <laughs> We're going back to take him to eat. And then I'm going for dinner. Fish and chips with my parents. Hi guys, so today's like literally a few days later, I haven't vlogged for a few days, but me and Reese have just been out taking pictures for bikini haul that I filmed the other day for like the thumbnail and Instagram stuff, which I actually just get so scared around Falmouth taking like vlog pictures here because I feel like everyone knows everyone and I was just like, if someone sees me that I know, I'd be so embarrassed, I stood in the middle of these rocks on a palm tree, you can't tell because it's shot from above. But I just stood in like the most random place. <laughs> I just look weird. Um, but we're going to Bahamas now for some drinks, for some cocktails. I'm wearing, wait, let me put you down. Right, you're balancing on my my book. But I'm wearing this dress, these shoes, the dress is backless. So yeah, gonna go. Hello guys, we're in Irish spot. <laughs> Yeah, nice. No, I think it might be called like Paul's something. I don't know what it's called, but it's quite nice. But, yeah. Hi. I'm with Hannah. Nice. World's Fair is Hannah's vlog. I don't know why I'm talking like it's fine. It's quite nice. No, we're in. Oh, upside down, we? Oh, yeah, you want to see We're stuff. in Falmouth. Oh, I can see myself. We've just been to Bahamas. We have some cocktails. Nice in here. Really cheap. Oh, well, we thought it would be cheap. It's actually not that cheap. We're here. Yeah. Was... I never said it would be cheap. Well, just drinks to do that. We both got daiquiris, which is so nice. Last week, daiquiris. Last daiquiris are so nice. I love I've got no shoulders. <laughs> then I got a gin topical, which is like gin and lemonade that looks and nice. pineapple. It looks fun though. The ranch right one is very good. And I got sex on the beach, which is so nice for my mother's. But I'm so tempted to And there's another drink as well. I got, um, what's it called? Cambian crush or something like that. Yes. That's nice. It's got tequila and that in it, but it's really good. Stronger. Uh, we'll keep you guys updated if anything happens. No way. <laughs> This is Hannah's camera. She's been rookie, she's been surfing. Yoga things. Wait, I'm going to show the sheet. Basically, I won this. That's what they do. So I'm going to come here with Beth. And we want to do Pilates, Pilates, and um, yeah, I won this thing on Instagram. So we get free lunch and drink. I'll show you my, my drink. It's really nice. It's so pretty. Our foods came. I got Avon toast with vegan sausage. And Max got Avon toasted tomatoes. It looks so good. Guys, I think I just got a job. Mm. Oh, my dad's calling me. Wait, I'll update you in a minute. Right, I just got the phone with my dad. He's walking the dog, so I couldn't hear him anyway. Um, but yes, I got a new job. Mm -mm. Woo! 
Look at my room. Well, that's still a mess. But I'm tidying it. I made some shorts yesterday, actually, which I didn't vlog. I haven't been very good at vlogging. But let me get off the radiator. They're just these. I don't know if you can tell. The fabric. Wait. That fabric. It's focused now. Like little flowers. There's some elasticated white shorts. And basically, I thought I'd have enough fabric to make the matching top as well. I needed 25 centimetres more, which was really annoying. But like on the same run of fabric. So basically, you end up just having to buy more. Which is annoying. Because that's because shorts stay. But yeah, so tomorrow I'm kind of busy. And then in the evening, me and Max are either booking flights tonight or tomorrow. Oh yeah, me and Max booked, um, book, book, we booked to go to the south of France. Let me pop down because my arms are really aching me. I don't know where to put you. I'll put you down here. We're gonna, I'm gonna sit on the ground. We're on that storage line as well. My camera's shaking. So I'm just excited. Yeah, we're going to South France, but I'm gonna go because there's my best coming around soon to cook and eat dinner. And I want to finish tidying my room. Hopefully we'll be in it when it's sunset and I've got my kind of new wetsuit on um, and then after that we might just order pizza and sit on the beach so exciting but I'm gonna go because we're gonna get in the sea. Woo. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why the camera looks so dark but hey guys it's Wednesday and I don't remember like a few vlogs ago we used to do a girls night like every Wednesday who's that that was Lisa coming in um but then everyone was like going home from uni and everything but a few of us are back so we decided we're gonna do it again but Charlie's also leaving so it's not really a girls night because the boys come, some of the boys come in tonight Charlie's leaving so we're gonna so annoying my camera keeps cutting me off I just wanna just wanna do a little get ready but yeah I don't know if I said but we're going to Palm Mama's for cocktails so we're going out i feel really dressed up i'm on lucy's balcony oh we're not gonna have this for long much longer what months left in this house but i'll show you guys my outfit wait where should i put you you're balancing on the edge so i'm gonna sit backwards i'm wearing this this really pretty dress i got this dress for 15 pounds guys it's so nice it's got sparkly butterflies all over it Look, can you see that? All these butterflies. It's so pretty. It's cow neck, but I'm just wearing it with trainers because I want to make it more casual, even though it's not really casual. But Lisa and her dress. I should have really given you guys a haul. We got some really nice vintage things earlier. But me, Lily, Lucy, some other girl, I don't know. And then the boys join us later. Get up with some drinks. But I'm going to wear it with a trench coat because it is a little bit windy today. I thought someone was coming out then. Just a window thing. I can't believe this is 15 pounds. Like, it's so nice. I've got this new What thing. are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I'm vlogging. <laughs> That's what Lucy's wearing. Hello. That's what I was about to say. I got this new ring from Treaty. So it's, I want, Treaty? Well, oh. I got, oh, yeah. I got some new earrings that I want to put in because I'll match okay. it. But. Do a little twirl. So nice. Guys, we're back. I'm trying to be quiet. I was very zoomed in because Max is asleep. We came back early because he's had his um, COVID jab, so he didn't feel very well. So he basically went for a few drinks, a pub, grapes, and then it's pretty expensive. I swear they put the prices up. But, um, I'll just take my makeup off. I'm trying to because I hate having a hangover in the morning when I'm drunk. So normally, sports Lucas Aid actually does it. You have to get the sports Lucas Aid normally kills the hangover, but um, I'm drunk with water. I've had some honey on toast get me um, but I'm gonna have some parasites well and I'm gonna have my vitamin tablets and some more water before I go to bed so then hopefully tomorrow morning I'm not gonna wake up with a hangover because even if I drink one drink I wake up with a 
over. I actually sleep for three days. He's asleep. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna get into bed. I'm gonna finish watching Bridesmaids. Morning, guys. It's the morning after a little drinks night last night, but I forgot to show you yesterday. Basically, or maybe I said this, I was working as a student ambassador and then it was just, no one was there, was not busy at all. And then there was a car boot on campus, so I was like, you know what, fuck it, I'm going there. Um, don't listen if you're a student ambassador, because I'll get in trouble. So I just killed some time, basically, of when it, work wasn't busy, just went shopping. So I wanted to give you a little haul because some of it was so good. There's one shop that moved, has moved from London, they've moved to Cornwall, and they're going to be based in Penzance, they're setting up a shop there. If I find out what they're called, they're called Market Cartel and the lady was so nice and I got some really nice bits, yeah, which I really want to show you guys but just ignore the mess of me. Wait, I'll show you, this isn't from that the vintage one, this is just from a normal, well it's upside down, car boot stool. So I got this green skirt and I just thought this is like the perfect kind of skirt for when I basically want to wear joggers but it's too hot because it's like jogger material it's adjustable like it's comfy and it's actually from sea salt so sea salt i feel like it's quite a popular brand here it's quite expensive and i got this for two pounds so i love that i thought it'd be just easy to go with the beach i then got i'm trying to find stuff not from that shop so so the best will last there it is so next thing i got was this really pretty like cami top mesh cami top it came with pants not gonna lie don't know if i'll wear the pants because i mean people like don't wear second hand pants they'll be washed guys don't panic but i think they're too big for me anyway and they're like huge they're like granny pants but so i have got underwear to match this anyway but now this is the vintage shop and the stuff is all just so nice and if this was in london or on depop the stuff would have been like 26 pounds each 23 pounds 30 pounds like you know like so expensive so i'm imagining like this store could have been like in brick lane if any of you've been there in london so i got this little cardigan thing and it's lined with like a shiny fabric beth's just coming in now just got out of the shower <laughs> i'm just doing a haul really my camera oh <laughs> my youtube girls <laughs> so i got this but i just thought that would look really nice in south france because i'm going there in two weeks with like a little white dress underneath a little top it's like a cropped cardigan and then i got this hang on just got a bit of black thread on that this cardigan top it's kind of like for lounge wear but it has embroidered wait where are they some embroidered bows on them i feel like you can't see that wait where is it there's the embroidered bows on it and it's really cute with a ribbon to do up and then it has a trim of like lace around the neckline and does it have it on the sleeves where are the sleeves yeah and on the sleeves so it's really cute and she gave all this deal by the way everything about shape for 17 pounds and i got these little like silk with lace trim on the back shorts actually they have a little lace trim on the front but a smaller like a thinner one which i thought went really nicely with i got this bralette it's like a creamy, just cute lace bralette. It has a rose there. I don't know if you can see that, but it should get stitched because it's not sewn on properly. But I just thought they'd look really cute together. And then I got this mesh skirt, which is so nice because it has a little blue bow. And I thought with a blue bralette or over a bikini to the beach, or I can make an underskirt to go underneath it and then wear it out. I just really like it. It's got all like layers of lace frills on it. And it's all just like proper vintage, which I was really surprised to find out a car boot. Then this top, which some people said they don't like. But I thought it just reminds me of when I first got Pinterest and I used to save shirts like this with this sort of detail, like loads of pleating and loads of buttons down it. I don't know, I saw a shirt on Pinterest, so I just thought I've got to get it because I'll wear it one day. And then the rest of the things I got were like just trims and fabric. So I got this, wait, can you see the detail? I got this funny fabric, if you can see the detail, because I thought like boob tube top, bralette underneath, sleeveless top I could make. So there's not much of it, 
but I can make a little sleeveless top. I then got this, hang on, this little blue trim, which she was like, you can make a boob tube out of. Look really cute. I can make some like little high waist, well, I can make some like little high waisted shorts that come in at the leg I thought I like, gathered with like this lace trim on the edge because I could easily find that. So I thought that'd be a good one to make. Because I want to make so many clothes now and finish my project. Because I then got this trim, they're all quite similar. All that focus. This trim has like got woven ribbon through it, lace and frills. So again, make like a little slip dress. This could be the trim at the top or something. Or on my pyjamas, I'm making some pyjamas at the minute. So then there's one that is the same but just a darker pink. I actually prefer this one and it's longer so I'll probably more likely make something out of this one. But it's just good to gather up all these materials because we had a talk about a third year and we basically just need to start collecting materials and stuff that inspire us or something. So I like all this but I've never made something with things like this so it could be an idea because I definitely want my collection next year to be like quite sustainable as possible like second hand um, which all these are so maybe that's the starting point but again like a dress but like this sort of thing at the top or like a little shorts and tops out or skirt and top but yeah, that's everything I got I think I probably spent well all that was 17 and then I got the little um, mesh top cami pants set which was a pound and then the skirt was two pounds I think oh and I got some earrings but they're downstairs some like little pink ones for my seconds but I can't bother to get them that's everything I got so I'll probably speak to you guys <laughs> Fesh just down there I'll probably speak to you guys later I'm leaving today so guys I forgot my camera but me and Lucy set up our own car boot this is still the same day as I showed you our little vintage haul but that's set up we've got literally like a million wardrobes worth here so I've already sold for some trainers just <laughs> chilling we've made like 20 pounds I think so far just sold my ex-boyfriend's top <laughs> and then some other things so looking good Hey guys, so I've just been to uni, I'm actually so hungry, but I thought I'd quickly vlog this. So I went to uni to get feedback on my most current project that I've just done, and your girl got a two one. I was 5% for first, and apparently not many people in fashion get first, so I'm close. So third year, hopefully do well, but I was so happy because yeah, I got really good feedback. Apparently my tailor jacket was excellent. Um, so it was just that I got so much good feedback, which was really good. So I'm really excited. So I'll just vlog it. Um, I'm out of breath though. But, but we basically got donated fabric from Telegno. And he came in. I was at work, unfortunately, so I couldn't um, receive the feedback personally from him. But my teacher told me that he was saying he really liked mine. And my garment was a conversation starter, which is really good. Um, and... That it's really hard to make a wearable garment wearable and bold and stand out at the same time and mine did that so yeah what well, i'm gonna go because making stuffed peppers downstairs well matt's making it for me and i'm just gonna break my cheese because i'm so helpful but yeah right guys it's future hannah now editing this video and max helping me um i forgot to film an ending so i've come to say goodbye Bye. <laughs> <laughs> I have nothing else to say, so don't forget to like and subscribe. I can't. No, you can't. You can't get into the zone with me here, can you? No, I can't. <laughs> um, okay. Bye.